have the videos to play, um, but you can see what they're demoing. There's kind of a 3D panel feel that you can scroll through. There are five different panels, tons of room to add widgets and icons and things like that. Um, one of the nice things is with the larger screen, they've improved the widgets where you can scroll widgets instead of just viewing it, launching it, anything like that. Um, but same Android market, and they've redesigned that as well. So the market is now designed for the tablet with different options for books, yeah. uh, music, games, things like that. Uh, Hi there. Take, can I take you down? Uh, sure. Thank you. Sure. Um, and pretty much everything has been redesigned for uh, the tablet, including the browser. We've got multi-tab, multi-tab browsing. Go through to. Uh, Tab browsing. All touch base with the uh, virtual keyboard. I can open up new tabs. So first time on Honeycomb, you've got multi-tab browsing. Uh, you've got a full web browser uh, with uh, Android, uh, with uh, Adobe Flash 10.1, so I can stream video right from my browser. No separate applications, as you'd expect from Motorola. Uh, things like YouTube, GTalk, so I've got a uh, front-facing webcam, 5 megapixel camera on the back, so I go into my GTalk, I find my contacts who've got a webcam, and fire up a GTalk session. So early days on the software, but gives you a sneak peek of some of the stuff that's uh, coming over the uh, coming weeks. Is it possible?